Now we're gonna start talking in a little bit more detail about some of the enzymes that are involved in those metabolic processes um, that are related to carbohydrates. So here we are, we are starting with glucose at the top. The first step that's going to happen is glucose is gonna have a phosphate added to it. The specific enzyme that is responsible for adding a phosphate to glucose is called glucokinase. And so here the glucokinase is, it, it uses ATP um, in order to add one phosphate onto glucose. And so that's gonna convert it to glucose 6-phosphate, or G6P. The reason this is an important step is because glucose 6-phosphate is now stuck inside the cell. It traps glucose in the cell. When we just have glucose up here without the phosphate, it can go in and out through that glute transporter. But once glucose has this phosphate attached to it, it is now trapped inside the cell. So that is the function of glucokinase, is to add a phosphate onto the glucose and trap it inside of the cell. Okay, so from here, this glucose 6-phosphate, it has many different, different directions it can go, depending on the energy status of the cell. So one way this glucose 6-phosphate could go is towards, gluco, uh, towards glycogenesis, where we can build it into glycogen. Another direction it could go is the pentose phosphate pathway, which we will talk about in detail in a second. Another way that this glucose 6-phosphate could go is to continue down glycolysis.